Question 17. The diagram below shows the arrangement of five magnets. Let's focus on this bar magnet here and this U-shaped magnet over here. And I'm going to focus on these two points, B and C. Now, since the poles of these two magnets are attracted to each other, what can I say about poles B and C? Are they like or unlike poles? The unlike poles, when facing each other, will cause the magnets to attract. So, these two poles, B and C, must be unlike poles. And since the question didn't label any poles, I'm going to label these north and south. Now, is it possible for B to be south instead and C to be the north pole? Yes, it is possible as long as the poles are unlike. But let's erase away one option. What about poles D and poles A here? Remember, a magnet must have one north and one south pole. So D should be north since I've already labelled C as the south pole and A should be south. So what we can do now is to quickly fill up the rest remembering that two unlike poles must face each other causing the magnets to attract. So we have the south here, north, south, north, south, and north. Now the same five magnets have been rearranged. And using the same poles that we labelled just now, let's check if the new arrangements are possible. So let's quickly fill up. C was south, J was north, and D was north, and I was south. So do we have two unlike poles facing each other, causing the magnets to attract? Yes, so we know that one is probably our answer, but let's check the other options, just to be sure. So we have A south and G south. Immediately we know that this is not possible because the two like poles that are facing each other cannot be attracting. They should be repelling. A south and I is south. Again, two light poles cannot be attracting one another. What about the last option here? E south and G south. Same issue as options 2 and 3. So this confirms our answer as option number 1.